somebody wanted to know if you thought that Newt Gingrich had a serious chance no. of a Republican. No. No. So who do you think, win who do you see winning the Republican nomination? Well, the Republican, the cliche of the Republican, again, I, 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 not, not I'm winning, not Jimmy the Greek and, 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 and uh, for, the, uh, who would, for the nomination. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. Uh, you know, uh, it, it's pretty white bready. The whole notion of Tim Pawlenty electrifying the Republican Party <laughs> and any number of other people doesn't seem that possible. The Republicans tend to nominate the person whose turn it is. And that seems to be Mitt Romney. But I think a lot of people in the Republican base are going to have problems with Romney because his health care plan in Massachusetts resembled, wait for it, the one we just passed. <laughs> and, um, you know, his kind of technocratic uh, uh, bearing is, is not exactly electrifying, certainly to the Tea Party movement. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think Newt Gingrich is cooked. Because? Personal, well... Let's just say that his, his own personal life, if he's going to run in a, in the, in the, in a values, um, <laughs> I, I don't, you, he's not right. running. <laughs> I mean, look, I, I actually think that some people feign running as a business proposition. They feign running because it raises their speaker's fees, people come out, they ask, oh, are you gonna run for president, Mr. Gingrich or Sarah Palin? And they coyly, well, I could possibly, and the crowds are bigger and more enthusiastic, and they ask more questions about art history. <laughs>